Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to install the chrome pieces for your 2020 Toyota Highlander. We're going to do the install for the front grill. With that being said, let's get started with the installation video. Before doing any installation, we want to make sure we clean the surface where we are going to install the pieces. So we're just going to clean off each panel. So we're going to start off with this piece here. This section of the chrome has a deep curve, so it is a little difficult to install. So with this one, we're going to have to take our time to install. So with this one, we want to start off by installing on one end first and making our way on installing it to the other end. So with this one, you want to give yourself a good amount of material. That way it covers the top piece here. And once you have it tacked down, you're just going to take your time and applying the rest of the film. And we're just doing section by section. So for now, I'm just going to place the rest of this just to hold it in place and work our way with this one. And use the bottom half as a reference of where you're gonna align. And if you need to fix it, just remove it and refix it. And you just continue. So then once you have most of it tacked down, the next thing is just applying heat, squeegeeing everything that we can, and then anything that needs trimming off, we just trim it off with our blade. And then for this section, we're just applying heat, that way we help the film mold to the curve. When it comes to applying heat and squeegeeing any material that you see that has fingers, I recommend applying heat and then just slowly working your way and removing any of the fingers. That way you don't crease the film. This part takes quite a amount of time, but just take your time on installing each section. And then if you need to reset, just remember to lift the film and try not to pull. Just lift little by little and align it. And then once you're done installing the whole piece, the last thing to do is just trim off any excess material. Okay, now we're gonna install the bottom piece. So with this one, it's just more of aligning it on the bottom. Make sure it's even too. In this one, we're just covering up to where the middle piece is. You'll see where it separates, so we're just covering up to there, and then just tack it down here, and then we just do the same steps here. And then once we finish applying it, it's just tacking down what we can, and then any piece that needs to be heated to help tack down, we will. So just tack down everything.
Okay, and the same steps that we did for this piece here, we're gonna do for the top layer here. So it's just starting off in the middle here and just covering all of the chrome. And then the film overlaps here. So just overlap it on top of each other. And then once we finish placing it, all we're gonna do is just add heat all around. That way the film starts molding to each curve. And then just finish off to the other end too. So this top piece is basically the same thing. It's just aligning right in the middle and then just working your way to each end. So just cover the middle portion and then just work your way. This one's more simple. It doesn't have much curve up to this end. And then just continue on with the rest, making sure you're just covering the chrome. And then just trim off any excess material that you have. And that concludes the installation for this one. It's just aligning it, working your way, applying heat on edges or curves, and just trimming off any excess material. We hope that this video helped you guys out with the installation. Don't forget to give the video a like, make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell, that way you don't miss any upcoming installation videos. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you on the next one.